Hi, I'm Christian. Follow me into Portable Winch World. No matter the anchor point at Portable Winch, we have the accessory for it. They're divided in two different categories. We have the ones for the trees and the poles, and we have the ones for the vehicles. We even have some accessories that fits on both sides, such as the winch anchor plate. To help you make the right choice, let's look at them separately. Let's talk about the anchors for the trees and the poles. The first anchor is the uh, polyester sling, really easy to install. You just put it in a U shape around the base of your tree and you clip it in your hooks. The one thing to remember, is that you don't want to go around the tree two times or more because you always want to apply the same pulling pressure on both hooks. Really easy, really fast. When you have a tree or a pole as an anchor point, a great product is the PC1263, the tree pole mount. The great thing about this is that it can be installed as a good height for a working position and also it can be used with two accessories. You have the uh, support plate, the winch support plate and the vertical pole winch support. So now let's see how to install our PC1263, the tree pole mount winch anchor. It comes with a three meter long strap and uh, a key for our ratchet system and you also have uh, rubber pads uh, here at the, the back so you don't damage your, your bark. First thing you want to do is install the hook in that bolt. You want to go in this position, not like this, so you're going to insert it like this. Then you lift the tree mount at the height of uh, your waist, you go around the tree with the strap and you insert it in the ratchet system. Then you tighten your strap on your tree or your pole. You make sure that it's in the correct position and also that the pucks are in contact with the bark when you're gonna tighten it. Then with the provided key, you come and tighten your system. Depending on the diameter of the tree, you might need to do a few turns and you're all set. At the end of the day, a little tip to unlock the ratchet system, you use the key, you push on it and you unlock it like this. Now that your tree mount is installed on your tree, you're ready to use your support plate PC1268. Really easy to install. Put it on your square tubing and with the bend pin and the R pin you lock it in position. So when that's done, you can install your winch, put the hooks through the eye bolts and you're all set. As you can see it pivots so it always aligns itself with the load. Once your first pull is done we suggest that you tighten your system just to make sure that everything is really well tight, really easy and fast. Important notice, if you need to pull from the bottom to top, you use a pulley to deviate the rope. Another item or accessory that you can use with the uh, tree pole mount is the vertical pole winch support. It is usually used with the PCH1000 or the electric winch PCT1800 for lifting. So what you do, really easy again, simply insert it in the square tubing, then you're going to insert your pulley, and then you have a nut and an R pin, so you hand tight the nut, 
and you stop when it touches the metal. The idea is just to prevent the pulley from lifting when you're, when you're going to use it. And you put the R pin in position. Then we're going to install the winch. Now that you're ready, you just install your winch on your support. Just put the hooks in the eye bolts. So now that your winch is installed, you need to install your rope. Since we're using in this demo a PCH 1000, we're using a rope that has a splice and a thimble. So as you can see, you cannot go through the pulley. But anyway, you don't want to do that because it's too long. So that's why you can undo it. So you remove the sheave. You put the rope into the sheave. You lock it in place. And then you can send your rope up. Then, important thing is that when you're going to use the winch with the vertical pole support, you're never going to use the front pulley of the winch. So you go from this, this pulley here to the drum. So you do your wraps. And then you go through your system here. And you're all set. So what is really interesting about the triple mount is that no matter the accessory that you're going to use, you'll always be in a stable position. You're going to be able to put it at a good height, so working in a comfortable position. If you need to work on a long period of time at the same point, it's going to be really nice. Another very interesting product to attach a winch to a tree or a pole is the PCA 1269. It's really light and easy to install. So like the other model, this one also comes with a 3 meter sling. So in, to install it, you insert the hook in the right position and then you go around the, the tree with the strap. So then you insert your strap in the ratchet system, you pull on it, you make sure that your strap is well installed, that your system also is in straight position and then with the handle, you simply lock everything in position like this. and you're all set. So when your anchor is ready on your tree or your pole, all you need to do left is to install your winch, whether it's a PCW 3000 or 5000. You use the anchor hooks into the openings, and you're set. And once again, you have a winch that pivots and align itself with the load really easily. Now let's talk about the anchors for the vehicles. The first two products we want to present are the winch support plate and the vertical pole winch support. In both cases, whether you're in Europe or in North America, you can use them. In North America, you're going to use a 50 millimeter square tubing or a 2 inch square tubing that you're going to insert in the receiver. And you're going to lock in place with the R pin. And in Europe, we have a North American adapter of two inches, install on a heck pack adapter that comes from Europe that you only have to put on the ball of the vehicle. The winch support plate can be installed on the European model simply by inserting it on the adapter, locking it in position with the bend pin and the R pin from underneath. And of course, same thing on the North American model, you insert it on the square tubing lock it in position with the bend pin and from underneath. Very simple and fast. Once your system is installed, all you need to do is to install the winch. So you put the hooks into the eye bolts. There you have a winch that aligns itself because it pivots and is really stable. And a very important thing when you're using a vehicle as an anchor point is to put on the end brake and put some blocks behind the wheels. Another accessory that you can use with those systems is the vertical pole winch support. So you can insert it, of course, in the European model, in the square tubing. But for the demonstration, we're going to use the North American model. So again, you put it in the square tubing and you align the holes. Then you insert the pulley. Then 
using the nut you hand tie it until it touches the metal underneath so it prevents the pulley from lifting when you're gonna use it and you lock it in position with the R pin just like that once our system is installed simply put the winch on it in this case we're using the lifting winch PCH 1000 simply insert the hooks into the eye bolts position the winch then we're gonna insert the rope how to insert the rope since we're using a PCH 1000 for this demo we use also a rope with a splice and a thimble just to show that you cannot always insert the rope into the sheave so anyway you don't want to do that because it's really long in some applications so this is why you can unlock the pulley so you can remove it like this then you can insert your rope and then just lock it back in position like this and lock it with the R pin then the rope can go upward then also really important when you're gonna put the rope on your winch in this situation with the vertical pull winch support you're never gonna use the front pulley of the winch so you go straight from this pulley to the drum so like this that you just insert it into your rope grabbing system lock it and you'll be ready to pull if you're thinking of using your vehicle on a few occasions to use the winch a very fun accessory is the itch plate winch anchor it's really easy to use and really fast and simple all you need to do is put the anchor hooks into the openings and then insert the hole on the ball and you're all set all you'll need to do next is start the winch and pull with the rope really really nice to use a little tip when you're using the itch plate with the PCW 5000 you need to remember that there's an oil alert system on this winch so the engine will be shut off if the winch is tilted on the side for more than 20 seconds at an angle more than 20 degrees to prevent that what we suggest is that you start the engine on the ground and then you put it on the ball so you're going to start it and then insert it this will allow you to insert the rope pretty quickly to prevent that from happening and you'll be ready to pull as you see at portable winch we thought of many different possibilities but if you have a specific situation let us know and we'll find a solution with you oh don't forget there's more videos to see